If you're lucky, you've got all your big Christmas shopping done, but maybe you still need to buy a few little gifts, something in the humorous vein. With us tonight on 207 from Bull Moose, Mick Pratt and Chris Brown. They've been checking their list more than twice, coming up with some ideas for last minute gag gifts. Oh yeah. Yes. Yep. Yes. I know these are completely serious. These are these are great gifts. The finest so minds serious. at Bull Moose, I assume, sat down for several weeks to yep. compile this collection. Yeah, mm. it, it's all based on machine learning and, and, and algorithms and, and so on and so forth. Very good. All right, let's get to it. Okay. Uh, we're going to count down from number five to yep. number one. Yep. So let us begin with number five on your list of last minute gifts. What do you got? Well, the the DVD grab bag is is actually a really really popular item, but it looks kind of funny as a gift because you know it looks like it looks pretty generic. I gotta say, it looks like a bologna sandwich kind of. But <laughs> but the uh, so the thing is, it's just uh, you pay five stack. bucks and you don't know what you're getting. It's DVDs it's and you don't know what you're DVDs. getting, right? Yeah yeah yeah, and and maybe there's something good in here. Better pi better pictures in five minutes. So a Nikon. <laughs> All right. Better pictures in five minutes. Uh, oh, this is better. Uh, the cardio. cardio workout. Oh, Reservoir Dogs. Reservoir. That's good. Whoa. That's res only disc one. Res that's all right. That's, that's okay. okay. That's the one the movie's on. Yep. Reservoir Dogs for five bucks right oh. there. Oops. That just disc one, one and three. And three <laughs> of, uh, of, of season one of Rescue Me. Of Rescue Me, me the Dennis Leary series. Yeah. Oh, we've got some more. Uh, and the, the rest is just a mystery. I mean, who, yeah, knows, who knows what else is in there? Yeah, exactly. Dune. Dune. Yeah, this is great. Love Laughs at Andy Hardy. Running time, 93 minutes. There you go. Anyway, so that's, that's great. And whatever Mickey this Rooney, is. Mickey Rooney Mickey, movie? It probably. looks like, maybe. Uh, yeah. American Dad. And the, so, the Blues Brothers. Yeah, it's just whatever. Yeah, so it's, 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 it's good stuff. It's like, what, eight, nine, ten discs in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, and, and I mean, Dune, Rescue Me, Reservoir Dogs are all definitely legit. Yeah. Five and, bucks? And they're, five bucks you know, a little dirty, some of them. Got it. Sorry, all right, ridiculous. number four on the list we don't actually have with us. But it has the best story of anything, oh, right? Oh, it's a heartwarming. So, so this is this is a completely true story. Uh, when I was still working in the stores a couple of years ago, I got a phone call from somebody, and they said, "Do you have the Kenny G Christmas album?" And I said, "Yeah, of course. We got we got plenty of them." She's like, "Great. I need to put twenty of them on hold." And I paused for a minute, and I was like, mm, "No, this is a prank call." But honest to gosh, she came in a couple hours later and picked up twenty copies of the Kenny G Christmas album. And said, I just heard a wonderful song on the radio, and I bought one for everybody on my list. Everybody in my family is going to get Kenny G this Christmas, uh, which is 100% true. And that's why it makes our list, because share in that story, share in that moment, mm. and, and get, your, get your sacks on, you know? Not, that's, <laughs> It'll knock your sacks not, on. Not everyone would agree with the choice, the musical choice, but there's a sweetness there there's that is that. actually touching. Yes. That's, and that's the kind of thing, like, if you work in retail, this is a really busy difficult time and yeah. so you need you yeah, totally you need. need things like that like yeah. that's that's what gets us through yeah it's 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 heartwarming it's Buying wonderful 20 of your favorite copies of your favorite album <laughs> and giving them to everyone you love what could be better all right number three on the list uh this one is going to require some uh description because yeah. i've never heard of this oh. the slug stampede well they're basically plastic slimy slugs uh here you want to hold one sure tear it open <laughs> and what do they do they Just, stampede. They kind of. They, uh, oh, they stampede. So when, we, when we put them on the table, they will they will sprint across. Well, as far as no, as fast as slugs go, it's a short segment. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Wait, you're supposed to be able to like? Do they throw them and stick to something? Yeah, you like. They kind of like flop around and it's so fidget spinners. That's yesterday's news. That's hey, that's worked. truly excellent. It did stick to the brick wall. <laughs> I don't see any movement here. Uh, you just have to. It, no. that was, it's crawling right down. Yeah, the, the, the one on the 207 sign is crawling right down. But anyway, yeah. so Slug Stampede, uh, you know, wonderful for kids that want to touch something weird and goopy. All right, uh, yeah. obviously uh, in the weird and goofy vein, although not slimy, but furry and soft, this is Bears versus Babies, but the gift is actually what's inside. What right. is it? Bears versus Babies. It's a card game where uh, the conceit of which is, let's see, what does it say here? The one that eats the most babies wins. Uh, so... What it is, is it's that from... That grim. Well, so it's from the, it's the makers of Exploding Kittens. So it's big with like the Cards Against Humanity crowd. So what it is, is you have a base bear, and then you, you attach things to your bear, like a shark head, like a laser gun, like a buzzsaw hand, and you just create these like horrific bear monsters um, and, and score points with babies. I mean, this is like not something for little kids, despite it's like fuzzy, pleasant packaging. For the people who found Reservoir Dogs too tame, yep. this is maybe the kind of thing yeah. they want. Yeah, yeah, no, it's 
Millennials love it. All right, which brings us to number one on the list. And in the mm -hmm. list that you presented to me, it said it would be to be determined. And Mick, uh, you have them on your two index fingers. So. <laughs> What's the official name of this product? Uh, they're tiny hands. Uh, you can you can buy as many as you have fingers. It's great. Uh, you can you can hide them inside your limit? coat. You There's can buy no more limit. If you you can buy more like if you, you want. Do, do what family. you were doing again, because we can get a nice close up of that and sort of uh, 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 people get the idea. It is kind of creepy. Excellent. In a, in, in a way that I kind of like. <laughs> so this is these are wonderful. They, it, it, it's, Nick it's was a, doing this when he first showed them to me. Yeah. Had them in his. Yeah. See. So oh you yeah. Kind of attach them like. You know, you kind yeah, of. It that's actually, even better. That's even better. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Um, um, so, if, yeah, this is that, the, the tiny around. hands, the if number one gag gift this year. Make yes, your hands great. every holiday gathering, then you need to find new friends and go to new holiday gatherings. Got to leave it there. Chris, Mick, thank you both. Merry Christmas yeah, to you. Merry Christmas Enjoy to you. Enjoy whatever presents you receive. And we will be back with more of 207 right after this. <laughs>